What's up, y'all? You all have tapped in with Black Goddess Intuitive Healer, and I'm here to bring you all messages for the sign of Gemini. What's going on, Gemini? How you all are doing on this wonderful evening? I hope you all are doing fine. I am doing well myself. I meditated on your energy and cleansed your space. And what I initially am getting from the overall message of you all's reading I got soul healing in the reverse. So with soul healing in the reverse, somebody is not healing here. Okay, somebody is not doing what it is that they're supposed to be doing here on this spiritual journey and or mission. However, it resonates to you. I feel like this is somebody connected to you and or somebody you could have a contract with here. Okay, another overall message that I got was visualization. So I feel like, Gemini, you can clearly see that somebody's not healing. Something's not changing here, okay? Somebody very significant to y'all situation. This could be y'all. So this could be your counterpart here that's not healing, okay? I do feel like this person isn't healing and doing the work that they're supposed to do with soul healing in reverse. Somebody is needing to heal their soul, Okay, somebody is needing to release somebody here. Somebody is needing to release a jealous spirit and or individual. Somebody is not wanting to close out a karmic cycle here. But somebody does want to forget. Somebody wants to come in and apologize here, Gemini. I feel like you already know that with the visualization card because you're highly intuitive here. Third eye. The number three could be very significant to your situation. Somebody could be 35 years old. Take these messages as they resonate. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And join the Soul Tribe and vibe with your girl, Black Goddess. Yes. Like the channel. Thank you, Spirit. But that's that was clarity for y'all as well. I feel like y'all have nurtured. Y'all have nurtured a gift here. And I feel like this gift is hella strong right now, Gemini. And I do feel like y'all can clearly, clearly see what's going on here. All right, we got a karmic soulmate here. All right, so this was like a cycle here. This was your karmic soulmate. This person turned into a karmic soulmate. It's mask off for this person. I feel like this this person could have been trying to attach themselves to y'all on an emotional level. This person could have been trying to put guilt on y'all. I feel like this person was highly narcissistic. I feel like this person is currently in this energy. I do feel like this person is pissed the fuck off right now because life is not working out for them. I'm definitely getting that energy. Thank you, spirit. I can definitely hear y'all in the background. <laughs> All right. So yeah, here it is. Cleanse your energy. So somebody got some dark ass energy and I feel like somebody is needing to release somebody here and clean, cleanse this situation because this is a karmic soulmate. So this is definitely a lesson behind this. That's why some things didn't manifest here. So this could be past energy as well. So yes, we do got a fake friend here, Gemini. Okay. Somebody was trying to stop your stop you from getting on this journey it was trying to stop your person from getting on this journey i've been getting this energy all night somebody was blocked from black magic here okay gemini i feel like this person was somebody was trying to stop somebody initially stopped this connection from coming in to union because somebody got healed here okay somebody also was trying to block you from moving forward Okay, this was your karmic soulmate. And if this person could have been working with one of your friends here to block you from moving forward. Dang, Gemini. Take these messages as they resonate for your situation. Okay, so Gemini, you are healing perfectly. This is past energy. You've already you already knew about this shit, okay? You had a dream about this shit. You had a dream about these enemies here, too. You sure did. It says you are healing perfectly. So you already knew about this shit. And you you knew about you was so you was 20 steps ahead of this bullshit. It gave you enough time to heal yourself. So once it all came out, it wasn't finna be no big deal for you because you had already knew about it. That's what's up. I like that. Yep, here it is. You already had the enlightenment on this shit. You already knew what was up. So I felt like this person kept trying to come back around and kept trying to pull pull up pull up the emotions, the emotional manipulation card on your ass and didn't want to close some shit out here, Gemini. But I see here that y'all closed this shit out and y'all ended it. 
Y'all ended this shit because like, like I said, y'all had dreams about this shit. It's like y'all already knew. Y'all benevolent ancestors was already kicking y'all ass about this whole situation. Y'all was having dreams and shit was funny. Shit was weird. And you start, she just started making sense. And then you like, oh, no, fuck this whole situation here. All right. Then you finally figured it out. You know what I'm saying? You could have been in your head for a hot second. You could have thought you was losing your damn mind without have. Yeah, you thought you y'all could have thought y'all was losing your mind here. What's money management spirit? Okay, so somebody held some money back here from you. Somebody could have been doing this shit for money. Somebody could have been lying on you about money because they're a damn hater. Didn't want you to win here. So, okay, I'm definitely getting that. So these people were working against you, Gemini, because they knew you were going, you were on the winning team. They didn't want you to win. They was trying to do black magic. That shit was blocked. You grew apart from this individual. Okay, so take it as it resonates. So I feel more like this could been this could have been a lover and a friend. Okay, I feel like that strongly. They was somebody was working together on your finances. Okay, and they was lying about certain shit. This shit was built on lies. This whole thing was built on lies. I feel like it's some it's a whole lot of ego shit going on. Yep, cause they already know. You coming from rags to riches is all about money with these hoes. It's all about money and finances. Motherfuckers is willing to die for that shit. These people was careless. They was reckless and they were soulless, Gemini. And they didn't give a damn about you. They were willing to break your heart over some fucking measly couple of dollars. But you move with integrity on this situation. Yeah, you spoke up about your, the betrayal. Yeah, you went through the motions. You cried. You purged. You wanted to whoop ass about it. But you didn't have a choice but to continue to move forward and do some motherfucking shadow work. You didn't have a choice. You couldn't whoop ass. You had to let all this shit go. You had to let this shit burn. You had to initially do your soul healing work. Because you got to see a lot of this shit before it actually happened. And you got a chance to, you got, you got an easy way out. This healing part was hard for you. But removing and releasing these motherfuckers, you learned your lesson. You didn't want to go back down that cycle again. That's definitely what I'm getting, Gemini. Remember to take these messages as they resonate. We're going to get a few more um, cards from the Chosen deck. And then we're going to, yep. These motherfuckers was jealous of you. I feel like that friend wanted to copy every fucking thing you did, you did, Gemini. And I also feel like that bitch needed to do some shadow work. Because ain't no reason. I'm hearing that your this this particular friend was pretty as shit. Okay? She didn't have she was just a narcissist and she had low self-esteem. I feel like she was lacking some type of love here in her childhood. You know what I'm saying? I'm hearing that this person was a beautiful on the outside. Very beautiful, but had a very jealous and dark spirit about herself. Yep. And she was always in lack mentality. She always was caught up in her head, always had anxiety about some shit. And she was highly manipulative. Okay, so that's what fucked her up. That's what fucked this friend up, okay? She was a narcissist, okay? She was always lying about shit. Always. I'm always lying. I'm untrustworthy. And I felt like you knew this shit. A lot of this shit you knew because you're highly intuitive. You could see the lies off of her. You could see the insecurities within her. You really, you started seeing that shit at the last minute. There's your confirmation. Yes. Yep. So this, this particular friend grew up in a narcissistic dynamic with her family from childhood. Okay. I feel like this was a family of narcissists. Okay. Narcissists is one step from demons. Believe that, okay? They show the same behaviors. Tricksters, liars, manipulative people. Yeah, so Gemini, y'all done released this person. Here we go. We got the jealousy card again. This motherfucker here, this friend, this person was so damn jealous of you. She was willing to stop your ass. She was willing to throw towers in your life and to stop you from getting to where it is that you need to go. She even stopped your person from healing. And I know a lot of this shit y'all couldn't believe here. Okay? I feel like this is a un she's an unhealed individual as well. She did not want to release this person. Okay? And that's why this person is not healing. Yep. This this friend had your person caught up in lies and shit. So she built she tried to build a whole foundation against you working with your person when your person was supposed to been 
get be getting himself together or herself, take it as it resonates, to heal for a twin flame connection. And this bitch caught she she tried she did she was successful with the black magic on him. She wasn't successful with the black magic on y'all though, Gemini. But they did. This person kept this this karmic kept y'all person in lies and defeat and illusions and shit. Had them believing different shit, okay? This person is no longer y'all divine masculine. Okay, this part they're deeming this person a karmic. Okay, because this person is sick. This person did some sick ass shit. I also feel like this could be um some type of um spiritually transmitted disease and or sexual. So take it as it resonates, Gemini. So uh, if y'all been getting like intuitive messages from y'all guys and stuff about this person possibly being sick and having some type of STD here, Gemini, that's your confirmation. Okay, I feel like this person had to learn some type of lesson because this person was not healing. Somebody was somebody's not healing here. So they kept going down the wrong ass. They kept going down the wrong road and somebody not healing their childhood trauma. I feel like this person is also blaming childhood trauma. Okay, I'm not taking that. But yes, this person could have anger issues as well. They could be bitter as shit. And that's another thing that they need to heal. Yeah, we got blessings here. What's blessings? Going down the wrong direction. So this person had blessings here, okay? Because I feel like they knew. I feel like this person knows that y'all is the blessing here, that y'all the true divine feminine, okay? And I feel like they mad as shit that they chose wrong over you. I'm hearing that they chose a friend over you, a little psycho Bob ass friend though too, Fiona. It says they went, she went, they went down the wrong direction with this person. Okay. So that's why I feel like, yep, somebody didn't have no type of spiritual guidance. People don't got protection here. So I feel like a lot of that black magic backfired. Okay. So somebody don't got some type of protection here. So they feeling that shit right now. Somebody is definitely feeling that backfire right now. Gemini. So if you were inquiring, oh yes, yeah, backfire, baby. You come out of eat any type of worry if, on whether and somebody going you yep. Hell no is yes in reverse. So come out of any type of worry. You are highly protected, Gemini. Okay, you are protected. Duh. You building generational wealth. You are walking in your divine light. Here's more confirmation. Absolutely. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, you are manifesting. You over here manifesting shit. You released, you released, you released these people. You did the, the soul healing work. You, your third eye opened. You meditated and you were nurtured. You nurtured your gift and now you manifesting. You're manifesting different shit here. Okay. For Gemini. Shit was coming in kind of slow, but it was it was it was up to you to to take the initial leap of faith with that leap of faith here. Sorry, y'all. Leap into what scared you the most. Okay, scared to tell the truth. I feel like this person was scared to tell the truth about what really happened here in the situation. All right, other deck. We finna get into this deck. So, what was this person scared to tell the truth about, Spirit, for Gemini? How much time we got? 19? Okay, we're doing good. What was this person scared to tell the truth? Whatever this person was scared to tell the truth about, uh, the truth about Gemini, y'all knew about it already. Y'all had done healed about it. Y'all just didn't have a clarity. This person scared to come in and just tell y'all some shit y'all already know the truth about. Okay? It says, this is somebody you removed. Yep. Yep, this is somebody you removed out your energy, Gemini. Okay, you healed yourself. You did the work with check yourself. Okay, this person could have possibly been, possibly did some type of financial fraud against you or was trying to. And this person could have uh, been some type of twin flame and or soulmate connection. I feel like they scared to tell the truth about um, doing fraud here. And they could have, they could have signed a, some type of check. Now they asses can't cash it with check yourself. Okay. I, 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 don't, I feel like these people didn't know. These people didn't know you were a divine being here. They knew, but they didn't know. You warned them who you were, Gemini, and they didn't listen. Somebody going to motherfucking jail. 
Or somebody could be stuck in their head about all this bullshit, even having to come and tell you the fucking truth. Somebody not getting no sleep here. Somebody losing sleep. Somebody need somebody is wanting to break free from this lie. Somebody is wanting to break free from this bullshit. They know they can't. This person know they can't keep running out of your life. This that runner chaser shit, Gemini. Okay, this your twin. This person not healing with healing is in a, healing in a healing is essential in a reverse. This person is not healing, but they do want to come in and get some type of forgiveness. Also, Gemini, forgiveness is for you. You know what I'm saying? This person ain't come, is scared to come around and tell your ass the truth because they stuck in their pride. This is a prideful ass energy. Yep, they stuck in their pride. So this person does want to come in and talk to you, Gemini. What else does this person, what else is this person scared to tell the truth about? Since they, this person scared to tell the truth. They, okay, I just heard them say, you know majority of everything. You know everything. You know enough to to continue walking away, Gemini. You know enough to continue healing yourself. You know enough. Intuitively, you know everything surrounding this. You know exactly what your ancestors want you to do. Moving forward, and you know what the universe wants you to do. So you're not blindsided at all because you're highly intuitive. You already know. You're an empath. You feel shit. Okay? So I can only think about you. I'm in my feelings. So I feel like y'all not in even in y'all. Y'all don't feel this person no more. I feel like this person could be blocked from y'all. Y'all energetically. That's what I'm getting. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, this person can't get you out their mind. It says every time she brings you up, she makes me want you more. This this toxic ass lover is obsessing here, Gemini. So this person is still in that 3D low vibe and ass energy. Could be having multiple lovers here. Okay, that's why this person is hiding. Somebody in toxic behavior. Somebody is definitely hiding. It says crossing paths with you kills me inside. Knowing you probably hate me. Now y'all don't hate this person, but they definitely hiding. But they oh they somewhere hiding, obsessing over your ass. This is my obsession card, Gemini. And whatever bitch they around, she making them obsess about you more by running her funky ass mouth about y'all, Gemini. That's her bad though. Daddy wanna come home. Oh, daddy wanna come home. Daddy wanna come home. Y'all going for y'all dreams here. Y'all thinking big. Y'all thinking positive, okay? Y'all are keeping the faith. Y'all don't even care if y'all don't see this person when I see you in the reverse. Yeah, this person hiding from you, okay? You could have you could have a karmic cousin, very significant to this situation here. Somebody wasn't listening when somebody was being warned. Somebody was being warned here to go down the right path. I feel like this person kept doing what the fuck they wanted to do, and that's just what it is. When you, when you don't listen to the most high, that's what happens, okay? All right, Gemini, like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Like the video. The love is free. I love you all so much. Remember to take care of yourselves, okay? And goddess will check on y'all later. Mwah.